It seems like we just started, but we're now closer to the end of the regular season than the beginning. Welcome to the pregame show. I'm Ted Madden. Let's get to the week seven highlights and big congratulations to the 11 inductees in the inaugural class of the Mesquite ISD Athletic Hall of Honor. They were recognized before the big rivalry game between North and Mesquite. Skeeter's running back Ladarius Turner broke off an 80 yard run early in the second quarter to break a scoreless tie. 7 0 Mesquite. North needed only 13 seconds to answer. On the ensuing kickoff, Terrius Younger took it the distance, 95 yards for the touchdown. The Stallions would miss the extra point, but their point had been made. The Skeeters led by eight at halftime, then scored three straight touchdowns in the third quarter to put the game out of reach. Turner was the story of the game with 209 rushing yards and three touchdowns as his team wins 42-22. The Skeeters improved to two and one in District 11-6A, good for a second place tie with Rockwall and behind Longview. North falls to one and one in district play. Mesquite has a big opportunity on Friday when they play at Tyler Lee. The Rebels are one and one in district. We'll see how Ladarius Turner follows up his 209 yard three score performance against North. The Stallions have a tough matchup against Rockwall, which has one of the top offenses in the area. North got another 100 yard game from Juwan Clark against Mesquite and another special play from its special teams with Terrius Younger's big kickoff return. West Mesquite had a big game with district leader John Tyler last Friday, and it was a close game too. Ty Jordan has been great for the Wranglers all year, and he helped them take a 15 to seven lead in the first quarter on this touchdown run. In the third, with West leading by one, Jordan broke off a 60 yarder to push the lead back out to eight, but the Lions scored twice in the fourth quarter to win 29-22. So John Tyler stays alone atop the standings in District 7-5A Division I, a half game better than the Poteet Pirates. West drops to one and one. With four weeks to go, this looks like a five team race for the four playoff spots. And that makes this next one a big game too. West will play in McKinney ISD's new $70 million stadium against a team that scored about 70 million points last week. Ty Jordan carried the load in West's loss to John Tyler, 27 rushes for 201 yards and two scores. Poteet is looking to win its sixth game in a row against a Wiley East team that was on the receiving end of that 90 point game from McKinney North. The Pirates' Tristan Golightly had two catches for 99 yards and a touchdown in Poteet's win in Texarkana a week ago. Mesquite Horn has the week off. The Jaguars are 0-7, but not out of it yet if they can win their last three games. That's it for the pregame show. Thank you for supporting Mesquite ISD Athletics and enjoy your games.